my hope for people viewing this artwork is that they would slow down and perhaps have a break from all the chaos around here and the noise and the construction and think, oh, gee, this is interesting. This is actually very peaceful. So my artwork is a simulated grassy woodland and the great thing is that that actual plant community was once existing on this site. This photograph here, the, the square format photographs, are taken with a Hasselblad camera and that is an old camera which is, uses film, as you can see here with this image of the gold dust bottle. And a second form of photography I've introduced to create a kind of collage of, of the two working together is more like a, an artist's botanic specimen. And this is called a lumen print. That's a juxtaposition of two completely different forms of photography. So now we're here at the National Herbarium of Victoria and we're looking at a number of specimens here that were collected by Ferdinand von Muller, who was Victoria's first government botanist and is, without doubt, one of Australia's best known 19th century scientists. He's been huge for my project. I've really, I've been interested in his work for probably three or four years now and I um, still find him spectacularly interesting. The State Botanical Collection has immense scientific value. It's used every day by scientists and researchers in Australia and all around the world. But it also serves as an inspiration for so many other ventures. In this case, um, it's really amazing that we have uh, an artist like Diana come in and use the collection in this way. So I'm holding a lumen print that is part of my artwork down on Anzac Station. And you've got the actual, an actual specimen. Yeah, so we've got the actual specimen here, um, collected by Ferdinand von Mueller in November 1852, which is pretty amazing that we have material this old here in the collection. Uh, one of the reasons why I was interested in, in lumen printing was because it was a photographic process that was being uh, created um, around 1850, same time that von Mueller was out in his horse collecting his specimens. So I thought that the lumen print process was for perfect for this photographic project. It's also interesting for us, you know, we work here with scientists every day and sometimes we think the collection is a scientific collection and used by scientists and botanists, but then we also just appreciate all its other elements, like the artistic elements, the historical, the cultural, and sometimes, um, you know, we can get caught up in the science, but it's so great when um, other elements of it are, are just, you know, drawn out so beautifully, like you have with your artwork at Anzac Station.